Hey guys, what's up? It's Daniel with Trail and Mountain, and today we're going to be doing something different. I have a new product. It's been a while since I've reviewed anything for you guys, so I apologize. I've been busy with moving and the holidays, and appreciate everybody still sticking around. So, got a new product from a company called Adventure Mate. Here's their website right here. Definitely want to make sure you check these guys out. This is the Swiss Army knife of multi tools, but to a whole new level. It's like the bigger brother to a Swiss Army knife. Here it is right here. It's a axe, saw, shovel, hammer, and a hook. It's called the AMV2. I'm gonna get it unboxed and show you what it comes with. And then we're gonna pop open a beer, we're gonna split some wood, and we're gonna have a good time. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, here we go. So let's see, there it is right there. We have a field kit. Let's see what's in here. Oh, that's pieces, so all right, I'm gonna rip that even more. Let's see, we have a, okay, so looks like we got some extra nuts and bolts. That's good to have. We've got a bonus saw blade, that's key. Got an AMV2 sticker, must have. User guide, how to operate everything, because it has the ax, hook and hammer, the saw blade and the shovel. And it's sharpened too, so that's really cool. I like the packaging. It's in color. Everything is made of recycled, even the box, so that's even that's even better. So we'll put that aside. Uh, so this is by a local Sydney artist. Rosemary Dime illustration. Here's your CO2 token. To let you let you all know the AMV2 product is carbon offset through a purchase of carbon credits, plus for every tool we uh, sell, they plant five trees, so kudos to them. Here it is right here. So this entire setup weighs just under five pounds. It has this really cool sheath, it's very industrial. You can put this on a belt loop. Not something I would normally carry, but if I was gonna be just kinda doing stuff around the yard, this would be something I would put on my belt, but the, the handle is really cool. It's kind of like magnetic. Kind of just snaps in place just like that. And then once it locks in place, this thing won't budge. So, and it comes off really easily. So here's the sheath. That snaps off. This just has, it says it's designed and assembled in Virginia Beach also, which is super cool. So that comes apart. And there's your ax right there hammer and hook. And this also doubles as a bottle opener, which we'll get to in a minute. Inside the sheath here is the shovel head. I said this is sharpened, so that's pretty cool. We'll kind of set that off to the side. Take that off. Here's the ax. It's already sharp. I wonder if I can shave with it. Yeah, yeah, it's a little bit. Cut some hairs. So AMV2, nice handle, really grippy. Has a little hole in the bottom here. And the way this works is there's this little handle right here. Kind of lift that up and there's a button. So you push that down and this thing moves up and then you just kind of slide that out. And there's your saw blade. So extra nuts and bolts for the blade. Really, really sharp saw teeth. And then this just kind of goes right back in. Just like that, locks in place. And then just, you know, safety first. Let's get the sheath back on there, so. That, and then you have your saw blade. So we're gonna use that. And same principle, push the handle, slide this thing forward. Put that aside. And the shovel goes in, just like that. Oh, it's not in all the way, hang on, there it goes. And then the handle goes down to secure it, and boom, you have a nice little shovel, so you can do digging. Yeah, this thing is awesome. And that thing comes out, and shovel handle comes off. This goes back in like so, locks in place, boom, you're done. All right, so, what you do is you get your favorite beer, get your hook, pop it under here. 
Boom, there it is. Not bad. All right, get your axe. I'm just gonna split that. Get a couple of good little whacks at it. Splits that wide open. Shot this way. Let's try the saw. Get the saw out. Done. This wood is pretty wet still, so, and it's hardwood. Not bad. Yep. Not a bad little saw. Does the trick. And you have an extra saw blade too with nuts and uh, bolts you can replace. Not bad. When you're done, lift the handle, push the button, slide it out, lock it back in place. Not a bad little axe. I really like it. This is perfect for car camping. The hammer is also really good for hammering in uh, tent pegs and the hook is really good for pulling them out and obviously for opening up beer. So really cool. I really like it. Shovel really good for getting through anything really so tough shovel didn't have to include it but I'm glad they did and it's sharpened too so it'll really dig through some hard soil nice when you're all done with your shovel, take that off, pop in the saw blade into the handle, seal it all in, done deal. And get the shovel back in the sheath, lift up on that little red handle, shovel goes back in. Sheath goes back in, snap goes around the handle. Boom. There it is. As I said, you could put this on your belt if you really wanted it to, or strap it to a backpack. You know, if you're going out into the backcountry for a while and you needed something like bushcraft related, this is a great thing to bring because it has multiple purposes. Plus, it's really hand, uh, handy, really grippy handle, feels good in the hand. It's not terribly heavy but not something I would definitely backpack with. But all in all, Adventure Mate, this thing is pretty awesome. Plus it opens beer, so cheers. All right guys, so that's my review of the AMV2 from Adventure Mate. Here's their website one more time right here. Make sure you check these guys out. These guys make some pretty cool stuff. And this is uh, available in Desert Sand too, so if you want something a little bit different color-wise, they have options for you. If you guys have any questions or comments about the AMV2, I would love to hear what you guys have to say. Make sure you leave those down in my comment section down below, and I will get back to you as quickly as I can. Also, too, please like, please share, and please subscribe. It really means a lot when people subscribe to my channel and like what I have to say about the gear that I'm testing. So thanks again for tuning in and spending your valuable time with me. I really appreciate it. Please keep checking back for more gear reviews, outdoor-related hodgepodge, tech and camera reviews, gear talk, and giveaways. Take care, guys. Get outdoors. We'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Ooh.